Hi, Rory Singh here from the PowerhouseMarketer.com. Today, um, here we are again doing another review of yet another new um, get crypto free opportunity called De DeFi Staking Platform, also known as DSPToken.io. Before I get started with this DeFi Staking Platform, and DSP token uh, .io review. I just want to let you know, I'm not an affiliate uh, who's trying to sponsor, recruit you, or convince you to invest. Some of you guys are probably wondering what the heck am I talking about? This is network marketing, guys. It's an HYIP platform revolving around network marketing. Okay, so I just got to let you know I'm not promoting it. Please don't ask me for my referral link to join. Um, I was asked to do this by one of my viewers. So before I get into that, if you're looking for a legitimate way to make an income online, part-time, and even a full-time income, my number one recommended opportunity you can find underneath this video, first link in the description. If you're looking for traffic, you can get traffic in the second link in the description underneath this video. One thing I got to say before I get into this DeFi staking platform review, the only people that actually make money in these type of deals are um, the affiliates while the system's up and running. Um, but most importantly, the anonymous company owners. Okay. There are admins of this. Somebody just, uh, you know, this platform didn't just arrive uh, and find itself online and create it, create it itself. Uh, it was created by anonymous people um, who are um, getting you guys to uh, fund their dreams, fund their opportunity. That's what it's all about. And the only people that usually make money with these type of deals are the affiliates. If they have enough skill set, if they have enough authority online, if they have enough credibility. So in truth, the only people who still make money online are people with skill sets. And with these type of, you know, crypto opportunities, it's usually only the one to 3% out of everyone who's involved actually make money. And then they only make money until it ends up in collapse. What does that mean? We'll talk about that in just a moment. I'm thinking there's like a ton of new people online because people are like looking at HYIP platforms like they're the holy grail that it's going to give you financial freedom. And I'm seeing a lot of uh, characters on YouTube promoting these deals anonymously and saying stuff like they're not financial experts and they create their channels only for what? Entertainment purposes and uh, that there's risk involved in anything that they're promoting. But to me personally, they are uh, giving financial advice. Um, they're trying to, you know, get you, get you to join so that they can make referral commissions. Okay. Um, let me show you a quick picture here. If you guys don't like truthful stuff, if you guys like this kind of picture, sunshine and rainbows, then this most likely is not the channel for you. You probably would have to go out there and search for like DeFi staking uh, platform review. And then you'll see the anonymous um, affiliates. Uh, and they're going to tell you all the sweet stuff that you want to hear. Like you can, you know, retire wealthy, get rich quick, etc. Easy with crypto okay if that's you right now and you're looking for sunshine and rainbows you're not going to find that here i got a lot of people who have come before looking for this then they went elsewhere they went to other platform uh other um youtubers then lost a lot of money one guy lost fifty five thousand. another guy i heard he lost over a hundred thousand british british pound sterling a lot of other stories of people losing money left and right Long story short, they come back in the end when they figure out that what I was telling them was the truth to begin with. Okay, so if you're looking for sunshine and rainbows, you're at the wrong channel. You got to go seek out someone else's channel, maybe learn by experience the hard way, and then maybe you'll come back here later for the, for the real stuff. Okay, so let's get into it. Defy staking platform by non-affiliate. Okay, and then what this is, is another HYIP, high yield investment platform. I'm seeing the words daily auction lobby, daily Tron dividends, lucrative training system, completely decentralized. That's just a load of bunk, a load of bullshit. Um, what I'm looking for, 
who is the community? Who are the owners? Who are the anonymous people uh, that started this thing up? Who are the anonymous people hiding uh, that have everything to gain uh, by getting all the gullible people to invest here? Who are they? Okay, so what we're dealing with is a case of anonymous ownership. I don't know who in the heck <coughs> in their right mind would ever send money to people they don't know. It's always important if you want to call yourself an entrepreneur or an investor to find out who you're locking arms with in business, wouldn't it? Isn't that true? Would you ever buy a car from someone you didn't know who they were? Even if, and maybe you couldn't even test drive the car? I don't think you'd do that. So why do people come online and doing all kind of craziness, especially during global pandemic? Is the government releasing some kind of gas in the air? I'm seeing that this year, 2020, all hell has broken loose online. People are doing the stupidest things I've ever seen, promoting scam after scam after scam. And then I've got other people come here and they say, oh, well, show if everything's a scam, show me what's really legitimate. Guys, anything that promises you that you could get wealthy for doing nothing other than dropping your money here is a big red flag, wouldn't it be? It's just common sense. Some of you guys may not want to believe this and have to, you know, I highly recommend you follow your own gut. I hope it's your gut that you are following. I want you not to listen to me. I actually want you to go out there and learn by experience. Do this. If you're new and you don't understand what I'm saying, it sounds like I'm bashing on legitimate business opportunities that are designed by anonymous people who want to help you get wealthy. If you believe that, then you got to go and try this out for a year. Okay? Invest your money. That's the only way to learn. Okay. That's it. So anyways, let me get back here to the review. So we're dealing with anonymous ownership. Second thing I'm seeing here, it's a passive investment offering. Okay? It still is. I don't care what stake your... Uh, Stake your crypto here and earn a passive ROI. Isn't that the idea? So it's a passive securities offering. Okay. Now, I did a who is search. It seems like this thing is what? Not even a month old. September 30th, 2020, this website was created. We're not even at October. We're not even at Halloween yet. So it's what? Like two weeks old? Brand spanking new. Okay, but I'm seeing that the registrar, the domain regis, uh, the registrar um, is this company here, which seems to be a UK incorporate uh, UK uh, owned company that owns <coughs> the servers that uh, is giving them service for this website. Okay, so what I got to mention, if they could be very well in the UK. And if they are, then they have to register with the FCA. Okay, or they, who's the FCA? You guys who are out there investing for financial freedom should know this stuff by now. Some people don't even watch these videos. They'll see, don't ask me for my affiliate link. I'm not promoting these schemes, guys. Okay. Um, got to say that sometimes I'll do a long review and people will still ask me, hey, can I can I join under you? Not promoting it, not promoting it. Some people are not, I don't think they're speaking English, maybe, and they're still, that's a very scary investing in, in, into schemes, Ponzi schemes, etc. So they're not registered in the UK or anywhere in the world. They're not showing any proof that um, they're registered to give you guys a legal passive ROI. What does that mean? They're not set up for the long run. They're not registered with the SEC. They're not registered with no one anywhere to offer you a return on your investment. If you want to stake your crypto here, then you are here to get a passive return. You stake it, right? I see the words auction, stake. It all comes down to you getting a passive return on your investment. Isn't that correct? Well, if that is the case, then they have to register with the authorities anywhere that they're operating out of 
if they're operating and being promoted um, in England, then they're going to have to register with the FCA. If they're being promoted in the U.S., they got to register with the SEC. If they're uh, being promoted in Thailand, right, Thailand, then they got to register with the organization over there. If they're being promoted in Canada, then they've got to register with the Canadian authorities. Very simple. If not, then it leads to the next issue. And the next issue or red flag would be, where's the revenue? How are they creating revenue to give you a return on your primary investment? Even if you're staking it here, right? Even if there's auctions going on, um, I'm not seeing any proof of any such auctions. I'm not seeing any such proof of anything other than talk of dividends, lucrative staking, completely decentralized, right? It's pretty, it's, it's pretty well simple. Um, so how do they get revenue? Is that even important? I'm thinking if I was an investor looking for financial freedom, this would be very, very important. I want to know how long is this thing going to be up and running? I don't want to donate my hard-earned money to people I don't even know so that they could you know, travel the world and build their dream. Some of you guys are here because you're told, oh, don't just have a job and build your employer's dream. At least your employer is giving you uh, a return on whatever you're doing to earn, uh, to put food on the table for yourself. So how do they get the revenue? They get the revenue here. So if you're a passive person, you are the revenue. What does that mean? Some people still don't know. That means rec recruitment. This platform, DeFi staking platform, is built on recruitment. If there are no affiliates, it means guys on YouTube telling you sunshiny and rainbowy stuff, right? Sweet stuff like you could make lots and lots of money, but they're not financial advisors. Um, and uh, there is a lot of risk, etc. And that their channels are just created for entertainment purposes. If you go there, they're going to tell you all the stuff you want to hear. And they'll e I see that they're even, you know, spinning. Do you're doing some psychology on you guys. Like, there's risk involved, risk in everything, blah, blah, blah. But just join. It's free to join. Defy staking platform. It's a network marketing opportunity. Free to join for all the network marketing professionals out there. But for the passive people, it comes down to you. You are the revenue. Once you guys dry up, that means once affiliate recruitment and network marketing recruitment dies down and they're marketing something else, what happens is the anonymous people pull a plug, meaning they, they shut this down and they scam run away with everyone's money. But they don't truly run away anywhere because they have like 10 or 15 of these platforms all working at the same time. Very, very smart. You don't even, they don't even have to be smart nowadays, this year especially, to make money. Uh, you just got to create a platform, slap it on the internet that promises wealth for everyone who wants to take risk. And you got, you got, you got millions of people, maybe even billions of people, this year lining up to just donate their money. They don't want their money. They just want to give it away. We don't want our money. We don't like it. <laughs> They're just giving it away to anonymous people. Oh boy, isn't that, isn't that hilarious? That is what's happening here. So this pretty well concludes my um, DeFi staking platform review, dsptoken.io review. It just looks like another Ponzi scheme. What is that? Some of you guys might be asking because I'm seeing like there's a lot of new people online that have no clue what an HYIP is. Uh, HYIP would be a Ponzi pyramid scheme, no products or services. Why would you need something like that? Well, there is network marketing. You see the referral link here, right? That means network marketers, you know, the guys who used to sell lotions, potions, and pills to family and friends who got pissed off. They couldn't come up with enough leads. They came online. People told them, hey, you can generate leads here. Now, lo and behold, a lot of them, instead of like bugging Aunt Becky and Uncle Tom to, uh, you know, buy their 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 toothpaste or their vitamins or their you know power energy drinks right hoping that they were going to get rich that way are now on youtube uh telling people hey we are not financial experts and they're going to go into a long spiel and all they got to do is show a whole bunch of gullible um people desperate people who don't want their money uh, just come and invest here and you can, you know, retire financially free. 
So this concludes it. I don't recommend it. It's just another silly idea. So what is a Ponzi scheme or a pyramid? It's if any of you were in legitimate MLM ever and you tried to, you know, find uh, maybe talk to your leads, uh, prospects. And did you ever have that question? You had a you know prospect come up and say, uh, is this a pyramid? Well, this is exactly why they said that. This is it. But most likely those prospects were pissed off. Most people who come into a home-based business, they just want to join something that you could just join it and get rich. And it never happens, right? You have to learn marketing skills. You've got to like learn how to do it. And then you got to go out there every single day and take action. If you don't want to take action, you're just wasting your time. And if you do want to take action, I don't recommend joining scams or promoting them. It's just, it's just a silly idea. Okay. But nowadays, uh, all kind of craziness happening. Um, a whole bunch of people are, you know, telling me that the sun is rising in the West and it sets in the East. Just because a whole bunch of people are saying silly stuff doesn't mean that a whole bunch of people are right. Whatever the masses do, always do the opposite. If the masses are investing into Ponzi's for crypto, don't do that. Always just don't do what they do. If everyone is zigging, then you got to zag. Some of the most wealthiest entrepreneurs on this planet have said that and have followed that advice. Very important. So this concludes my review of DeFi staking platform as well as DSPtoken.io. If you're still here, you're looking for a legitimate way to make money online for yourself, earn a paycheck, Power, two powerful systems underneath this video. The first one is my primary. The second one is just a traffic opportunity. But both of them, one thing, one thing I got to say, they both pay every Friday. The first one has been uh, in existence, both brick and mortar businesses in the U.S. and both offering products and services that the great majority of people online who are trying to make money need the first one is offering leadership skills marketing skills i'm going to get some characters going to see this review and spam their link and wonder why no one's joining them spamming your links on youtube's a silly idea the first of all the algorithm some people don't even know what that is youtube itself will just put you in a spam folder half the time. And then if they do somehow, if you're, if you're spammed links of your crypto does get through the algo and it's being displayed under someone's video, most people would just uh, mark you off as an inexperienced marketer. People don't want to join anyone who they think is in a worse position. Whenever you, you spam your links, People think you don't know what you're doing. I wouldn't want to join you, no matter uh, if you're promoting something legit or illegitimate. Very important stuff, isn't it? So if you want to learn marketing, number one, first link underneath this video. If you want to, if you want an opportunity to get traffic, everyone needs traffic. Second link underneath this video. Pretty simple. First, first link. Uh, brick and mortar company been around for five years. The second link brick and mortar company been around for 18 years, right? Legitimate stuff. They have products and services of value, but most importantly, both of the opportunities underneath this video have enough retail. What does that mean? Retail. That means we have a lot of customers just getting started with us for the products of, and services for the training and for the traffic. Okay. And lastly, before I go, the only people that make money in affiliate marketing, um, make money online world in this industry are the people with skill sets of marketing. And then more importantly, the top one to 3% out of everyone involved are the only people that make money online. Anyways, guys. Hopefully that made some sense to you. I'll see you guys on the next video. Take